What's going on guys? Thyromex here, back with another Minecraft video. Today, we're traveling through outer space. Nope, just kidding. The end city dimension actually, because last episode we fought the dragon. There's the gateway we went through last episode and I now have Optifine, I can zoom. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And this can go above 32 chunks to help me out. How about 40? My PC should be fine in general. All right, cool. So yeah, we've got one goal. We've got to fly today. I want the Elytra today. That's what we're doing. Let's get a move on. We have to find End City and of course, the End City loot. Oh, there it is. We found one already. Oh, there we go. That's we're off to a good start. Let's see if it's got a ship. Guys, all I ask is you subscribe if you enjoy. Please, please do that for me. We are so close to 150 subscribers. That would help me out so much. My goal is to hit that by the end of June. You guys could help me out. Thank you. Takes two seconds if you didn't know. Watch until the end to see this happen because I've got a surprise right in front of me. Not one end city, but an end city with a ship. And this scene has been amazing. These shulkers. The city at the end of the game. More like the beginning of the series, if you ask me. There we go. Here are the chests. Ah, there we go. Here's a nice sword. Okay, protection three. And all right, this is a good pickaxe. Okay, we could still die, though, if we're not careful. Wow, what a genius. Look at this. Not one end city, but an end city with a ship and a second one with a ship we are getting both today man what are the chances we've actually got good luck this scene has been amazing for diamonds this scene has been amazing for exploring this scene has been amazing for everything this scene has been amazing with the stronghold giving me the portal right in front of the entrance and it has also been amazing in giving me two end cities like there is the end there's the end gate right there there's two end cities with a ship in front of me like wow my last world was not nearly as lucky in fact it was pretty unlucky we just can't fall we just can't do anything stupid there's no need for us to go over the void please nothing stupid happens okay i think we're good okay my my game volume is fixed let's head over here i'm always scared of throwing a pearl oh there's an end gate even closer bro this is the this is the best episode ever like this and the last one just so lucky by the way, me getting the Elytra and all that, it's only the beginning of the series. I can guarantee you that. There's so much more to come, man. Stick around. This right here, like, this is a good sign. Let's take care of these shulker boxes. Okay. These shulkers. The city at the end of the game. More like the beginning of the series, if you ask me. And we've got looting three. Well, that's really great. I could have installed that data pack that gets you, like, two shulker shells, which would have been great. But, uh, I just, I don't know. I was... I just want to get this episode done and recorded. I'm going to be gone for the weekend, which is the time when I, which is the time I take to record an episode. So I had to get this done extra early. Got no time to waste. Let's fight through all of these guys. It shouldn't be hard as long as we don't do anything stupid. Yeah, take me higher. Why not? Just die. There we go. We can get these banners as a trophy. Take some end rods, I guess. You can also craft those. There we go. We, we got enough to make at least one shulker box. Because you need two shulker shells and a chest to make a, a shulker box. Which will be such a game changer along with the elytra. There's the ship over there. We've got we've got a head higher. Get some loot out of this as well. We can get some really good stuff from this place. There we go. Here are the chests. Let's take care of all of these guys. Come on. Don't close. Stop closing. I gotta make sure I eat up. I wanna get to the chest, but I wanna take all of these guys out too. Oh, of course he teleported. Just die. No. Okay, you teleported. Whatever. Okay, well, there's another ender chest. Might as well empty some loot in here. Ah, there we go. Here's a nice sword. Uh, no. Another saddle. I'll take it. Let's just use an ender pro while we're here. Okay. Let me take you out. You're annoying me. And somehow you knew I was there. These guys are hackers. Just die. Thank you. You can see me through the window. That's not how mobs work. You know this. Stop teleporting. Man, you guys are hacking the game. Let's just head upwards. All right, there's some chests here. Ah, okay, we'll take those. Uh, it's got Curse of Binding. You know what? We can take these and just disenchant them for XP. 
while we don't have a great source of XP yet, you break slower while you're levitating. Okay, there's the entrance to the end city ship. I think there's another chest room here. Yep, there is. Oh man, these guys, these guys do some damage after a while. You know what? Just to be a little less annoying. Let's just gapple up. Okay, protection three, fire protection, eh, nah. And all right, this is a good pickaxe. We can add this to this and have our first mending like full maxed out tool. In fact, I don't see any reason why. Well, I do see a reason why not to do it right now. Let's just block ourselves in. Let's take our anvil out. Let's make our first full maxed out tool. We will now have a fully maxed out silk touch Efficiency 5, Mending, I'm breaking 3, Pickaxe. And it's ready to be turned- it's ready to be turned into Netherite. The 20 levels are worth it. There we go! Okay, we could still die though if we're not careful. So I want to be careful, obviously. Wow, what a genius! What a genius I am! Okay, shoot these guys first and that'll be great. There is another end city over there. It looks like a bad one from here, but maybe the rest of the- Chunks aren't loaded in yet. Okay, let's just let's just do this. Oh, we did it. Nice. Let's get the shulker shell. There we go. You're joking. There's another end city. Four end cities. This is end city country. There is a third end city ship. What the heck? Look, end city, end city. This is an end city. That's an end city. And over there is literally where we spawned. Can we see the end the end gate? It's just out of render distance. I mean, sure, that's a, that's a poor man's house right there. Oh my. I don't think we'll get all three this episode. If I ever want to raid another end city, it's right there. But let's go ahead. Mind this, break this, get the potions. What are they? Instant health? Okay. And get the elytra. Right now. Done. Sky's the limit. Let's go. Look at me. I finally got the elytra. Woo! Oh yeah, looking nice. Just need to get them shiny, you know? Get some mending and I'm breaking on it. Yeah. Uh, no. Ah, we'll take that. But none of it compares to beautiful Elytra. And we've got 11 shulker shells, nice. Something I can do is try, um... Well, now that we've got this, I... I think we're pretty much done with this end city here. Let's head over to one more. Let's head over to this one. Or is this one closer? Uh, they're like a similar distance. Oh, I don't want to fall right now. But we've got the elytra, so we're safe for now. In fact, let's take our first little glide test. Okay. Oh, we did not land. Wow, we took some damage. We gotta be careful. I, if I die here, I'm, I'm just, I'm done. Uninstalling the game. Okay, let's glide over there. We can do it. We've got an, en we've got ender pearls and water to save us. All of that. Actually, I can build higher and then try it. There we go. This is high enough for now. There we go. This height will do. Let's go. Ooh, our first real glide. Look at me, man. On to the next end city ship. Should have brought fireworks. That would have been great. All right, here we go. Let's get a smooth landing. Okay. Oh, wow. Landed up here. I'm not going to bother too much with showing you everything now since we've already done that once. All right, so let's go ahead and grab these potions. We've just conquered this end city over here pretty much fully and taken out almost all the shulker boxes, except those who have teleported away, gotten all the treasure loot pretty much that I care about. Let's take out this last guy here. Oh, they all keep teleporting away. Let's shoot these whatever levi levitation balls. Let's shoot these levitation balls away. You teleported over there, I see. Any day now. Okay. Cool. We've got so much stuff in this shulker box and in our ender chest and in our inventory and all that. We're going to be able to make plenty of shulker boxes. Keep a bunch of spare like armor and tools and disenchant them. But there we go. Our second elytra has been acquired. Okay, I'll take these. 
Okay. Hey, we've actually got some pretty good stuff. Nice. One of the first things we can do is mend. We can make like perfect leggings right now. Bind these to make protection four and this to make protection four. I'm breaking three mending diamond leggings. Nine levels. I guess we'll start with that. There we go. We've got mending like full maxed out leggings. I don't want thorns three on these. Thorns three ends up annoying on the long run. Because I know some people are like, what? Basically, I don't really like to wear thorns on my helmet, leggings, and boots. Because if I ever want to do stuff with mobs and, and I need to lure mobs, especially if they're hostile or whatever. Like, for example, zombies for villager stuff. Then having thorns on is so annoying. But I'll have it on my chest plate because I'll... For the most part, I'll only be wearing my elytra. But I'll wear my chest plate when I need it in, like like big boss battles or like for when i fight the wit or 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 do like big challenges or or do a raid or go to a woodland mansion that sort of thing when i really need it i'll wear thorns three i'll wear my chest plate which will have thorns three on it and that should save me when i want it to we are literally out of levels from that dragon fight we had like 64 levels a stack of levels you could say I could use uh, a few more ender pearls in case. There we go. You don't stand a chance. You know what? One more fight just because I feel like it. The worst part is your voice, not even how much damage you do. There we go. Let's head over here. I keep falling off of these. There we go. Let's head home. Okay, I thought it didn't work for a second. Okay, so we're here and then all we got to do is go into the end portal right there this is our battle scene from the ender dragon and we will come back here within a few episodes to make one of the best xp farms in the game roll the credits i'm bored already okay so we're back here what i could do is i'm going to gather this obsidian make a portal here and head back through the nether that way I'm killing two burns with one stone. I'm getting home faster, first of all. And we can link up a nether route to here because that's something I, I just wanted to do. We got to make more use of the nether for, you know, for nether travel. One eternity later. So I have now moved the portal a few blocks into the properly linked location. So this portal in the nether is now properly linked up in the portal to the stronghold. We can go through it and check. There, perfect. But yeah, I've added this pathway. <laughs> Terrible pathway, of course, but it's a pathway. Yeah, if I had the coordinates of the portal or base location portal, then I would have been I would have been able to make a much more efficient, straightforward path. I, I bet you the stronghold portal is right over there. So I could just like have some sort of staircase, a little path straightforward, and our base portal is over there. So it would have just led up a lot quicker and easier. But we have to do all these twists and turns for now. This is temporary, of course. We'll make a much better one. We'll make like a nether hub and all that. If you don't know what nether travel is and linking up portals and that sort of thing, look up a video, especially if you're a survival player. Super useful to know, trust me. And yeah, look at that, we're back home. And the sun is rising, would you look at that? We've got our elytra, we just need to add unbreaking three and mending on this. But we can take our first flight right now. Yeah, we've got a bunch of stuff to sort out. I'll sort this out in between episodes. But look at all this. This is everything we've been able to pull together from the two end cities that we raided. And there's a lot of junk in my inventory as well. But yeah, like I said, we can make some fireworks, grab some gunpowder, make some fireworks. All you need is gunpowder and paper, by the way. And look at this, we can take our first flight and view the world from above. Oh yeah, look at this, man. This is how the world looks like. This is how the town looks like from above. I've never seen it from above before. Hey, it's a good start. It really is. Like, look, we've already cleared a decent amount. All of this used to be like trees and stuff. We've already cleared out like a huge rectangle. Gotta watch the durability. I'm not gonna be using either of my lighters much until we get mending and I'm breaking on them. We'll use them when we really need them, but I plan to get the books needed to enchant these super soon guys that's going to take care of this episode thank you all for watching i appreciate it a lot if you enjoyed then please please before you go just drop a like 
it's a huge help and it lets me know that you enjoyed it we are so close to 150 subscribers if you can help me out with that i'd so appreciate it you made it to the end and if you're not subscribed like what are you doing you can change your mind whenever you want hopefully we'll be able to get 150 before the end of the month that'd be really cool but yeah enough of the outro thank you all for watching i will take care of the inside of the house maybe in between episodes now yeah that's something to do all right see you guys stay tuned for next time bye